Yeah. All right, this is Load Runner. The legend returns. I loved this game when I was a kid. Kind of an action puzzle type game. I was obsessed with it for probably about a year. All 150 levels of it. We're not going to be playing 150 levels right now. Uh, I think we're just going to have some fun, go through many of the levels, get that Load Runner feel, and uh, let's just get into it. If you're not familiar with Load Runner, you're about to find out. This is what it is. So you're this guy, and I think we can speed things up. There we go, a little faster. So we're this guy, the Load Runner, and he has to collect, let's get that mouse out of the way. He has to collect all of the uh, the gems, whatever it is, whatever it happens to be in that level, and uh, get to the exit, basically. Hi! <laughs> That's fun. Programmers have fun. It's nice to see that on display. I like the music in this, too. Very tribal. A lot of, uh... I feel like Toto would have signed off on this soundtrack. At least... At least the Toto that recorded Africa. The Toto recorded all their songs, but I'm saying specifically Africa-era Toto. So, Load Runner, as you can see, can shoot the ground uh, to get get in there <laughs> and access other areas. Getting all the treasure here. We can't shoot into these, uh, I don't know, sort of little road area on that or whatever, but that's fine. So you'll see already, they're introducing a little more challenge. We're like, all right, so we gotta go two wide and one down. All the treasure. Two levels down, how about that? You'll notice the ground fills back in. Which is nice, because otherwise we'd be screwed. Oh. And we get an extra life every time we clear a level. All right, we have our first baddie. That is a cannibal. Steer clear of the cannibals, just like real life. Um, I think he swallowed up, so we can make them drop into pits, and then they do this weird, like, Jesus move. I don't even know what that is. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that is. But the ground can swallow them up like it just did, and that can be good for us. Um, but then they respawn. They have unlimited respawns. And true to their name, they will eat you if they catch you, so let's not get caught by the cannibals. Not on level three, at least, right? <laughs> All right, I don't like that for whatever reason the game is slowing down with more animation on the screen. Like, I could see that happening in the mid-90s when uh, this game was fresh, but uh, I don't know. You wouldn't think on this setup that would be an issue, but what are you going to do? Or I could just say we went for the authentic experience here. Actually, I'm going to leave that one at the bottom right. Because, yeah, they can hover, too. <laughs> Learned something about cannibals today. Got to pick up the skulls as well. Any Anything that's gold is essentially the treasure. They look like Necron 99. I don't know what Necron 99 is, so I will have to take your word there, Mono. Yeah, Burger Time vibe, uh, Pac-Man vibe, if you will. You gotta get all the things, and you have dudes chasing after you. Glorified Pac-Man. That's selling the game short, though. I love this game. Uh, and as I said, there are 150 levels. After a few more of these, I say we skip ahead, because each... Uh, th those 150 levels are broken down by different... Uh, just themes, basically. Different backgrounds and things like that. And uh, so, we actually have the ability built in to the game, thankfully, to kind of warp to any level that we want. So we can uh, just jump around. Because as much as I would love to do all 150 levels, I'm not sure I have the appetite for it right now. Ooh! <laughs> Sorry, loader. Ooh! There are a lot of other versions, so yeah, this is the Legend Returns Load Runner. They had uh, the original Load Runner from the 80s. 
love that sound blaster. I love that we're moving faster now. Now we only have one dude. Cannibal's well versed in the uh, the rope climb. Suck it. Let's slow him up a little bit more. Well, we slowed ourselves up too. <laughs> With the graphics, that's okay. Ah, dang it. Did ourselves a disservice there. Remember introducing this game to a friend of mine when I was, oh, that's handy. When I was a kid and playing this late into the evening after we went to some church function at his church that I just kind of got roped into going to for whatever reason. But they were doing like a gambling type game at the church. It was kind of weird actually, but I made some money. I made some money at a church. Didn't go to church myself, but I was like, I'll hang out for this. And I ended up doing pretty well at whatever that game was. Random memory, doesn't matter. You don't need to know that, but there you go. That's what I think of when I think of Load Runner. Buddy Mike when I was a kid and the addictive nature of this game. I'm not sure I can, oh, I can't, okay. Wasn't sure I could burn up the ground. Let's see. I think if we... All right, that worked out. I kind of got myself in a no man's land there for a second. I was freaking out. That's sweet church money. I don't think it was bingo, though. When we're talking about the game that I... It was like some weird game that I've never seen since. But apparently I had a knack for it. Or they're just like, hey, let this kid win and maybe he'll join our community. <laughs> this eight-year-old kid or whatever I was. Ooh. I don't like that the, the cannibals pick up the coins sometimes and they drop them when they go into the holes. Keep falling. A lot of cannibals here. A lot of cannibal action. By which I mean two, but... Yeah, my memory was better. I don't talk to that guy anymore, so I can't say that. was. We got very close to being eaten there. It was no joke. All right, let's slow him up. And I'm hoping, assuming, the exit is right here. There it is. All right. Let's skip ahead. This is pretty straightforward, right? There's so many different puzzles. That's... It seems pretty straightforward at first, but they uh, they present the same kind of mechanics in a lot of different ways. Um, and introduce a few more things as the game goes on. Not too many. A few items, and then there's like a there's like a like a bug spray you can use on the cannibals. A cannibal spray. Just say no, thank you. Fortunately, the cannibals haven't learned the art of flying off of a ladder at top speed. And they get kind of in a glitched out pattern too if you, you're not on the ground when they... All right, so one of them picked up a gem. Which one of you guys picked up a gem? Be honest. Was it you, right? Yeah. Yeah, it was. So now we gotta we just do this. Do one of these. He's gonna get eaten, right? Oh, how did that work out? That shouldn't have worked out. All right, do the math. Am I gonna get there first? There we go. Beautiful load runner physics. Yeah, they only say hi in level one. After that, the pleasantries are over. And you dive head first. All right, this will be the last one that we'll do in this forest area. Because there is a new mechanic in that, that being the key. So in this case, we do need to get a key. So the exit's going to appear. We'll need to get these cannibals far away from this area so we can get that one gem. So the exit area is going to appear behind that door, but unless we have that key, we can't actually get to it. So it's a two-step process getting out of this area. <laughs> Logan's run, yes, yeah, very different than Load Runner, but I can see the mistake. Ah, oh, we got eaten. Got our first death out of the way. That's good. Very graphic too. He makes a meal out of Load Runner. It's very dark. I think my parents knew I was playing action puzzle games where the character was eaten by cannibals. 
they might not, uh, they might not have been, uh, they might not have approved. Not to say they would have been okay with me being eaten by other creatures, but it's very, it's very dark. Soylent Green is so depressing. No one survives in Soylent Green. Spoiler alert. Super sad movie. It's a good movie, but it's super sad. One of those movies where you're like, huh, that could never happen. But like with each year later that you see it, you know, with like present time and everything, you're like, well, maybe. We said that about a lot of things, and now I'm not so sure. All right, we need to get these cannibals out of here. Let's see if we can draw them down to the floor. Get them to chase us somehow. Here, come this way, dummies. Gotta get that sweet spot so they follow me. They will eat me on the on the ladder. All right, I think we got them now. All right, so that bought us some time. Well, they're Tweedledee and Tweedledum are uh, giving chase. Let's see if my brain can figure this out. There we go. Picked up the key. So I definitely need to... Well, Oh, okay. I was overthinking that. That's fair. All right. We're good. <laughs> Pee on the ground. <laughs> what's the uh, what's the command for using the key? Down. There it is. All right. So now let's check out the very lovely go-to puzzle feature. Control G. Oh no, yeah, that's fine. I'm not going for the high score here, spoiler. Uh, I wanna go to, there's 150 levels. I think it changes every 15. Meaning, well, 16, you know what I'm saying, on 16. I think, I just wanna get a different background here. Bomb throw, different background. There we go, the mines. And the music changes too. I like this. So we got bombs now. Heck yeah. Uh, okay, then give me a bomb to get back out. Oh, oh no, I didn't, yeah, forgot. One bomb would obviously set up another bomb. All right, learning the proximity of the bombs. On this faster speed, they actually go off pretty darn fast. This game was, I don't know what year this game was from actually. In the mid 90s, early to mid 90s, 94. Thank you very much, Mono. Yeah, it only affects the non-tiled ground. All right, I almost did it again. Damn it! I was very worried about that block reforming, and that's why I did not get clear of the blast zone. So I thought it was gonna Re, uh, respawn before I could get out of there. Or get through there, I should say. Well, it shouldn't... The faster speed should make it respawn that fast, because, you know, it's really just a question of my reaction time, and I don't think there's that much of a difference on this faster speed. Not a huge drop-off. This we can use our good old fashioned gun. I don't know. Is he shooting the ground? I don't know. Interesting mechanic. 
I don't know if you get different musics depending on how well you do, or how quickly you knock it out. Is there even a timer? I don't know. I don't think there is. I don't see one. So we use the bombs as a defensive uh, maneuver as well against the cannibals in some cases. Can I just, like, go over there? There we go. It's going to blow up all these bombs, isn't it? Okay, just that one. Handy. Like he just runs across, even though they're clearly ladders. Sweet. Oh, damn, they just blow up! <sighs> this is one of those. Alright, we have a finite amount of bombs here. Hopefully, I'm out of the radius there. There we go. Very strategic here. This is drop it here and swing around and pick up the gold. And head back up. Sweet. There we go. Do a handful of each before we move on. So we have the bomb mechanic now. I'm sure that's like the major addition. There might have been some in the forest, actually. I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> I like when the cannibals, like, goes, starts, you know, he gets to a certain point. I make a move and he goes, oh, son of a, I was just there. So clearly, he has to be, like, at the top. I died. How did he not die from that? Maybe I need to go straight down the ladder from the start. I don't know. Jeez. Oh. He's like, I like my load runner slightly cooked. Thanks to that bomb. We'll find out to answer your question. Is there a new ability every every new area? This one's like invincible. I understand this guy. I guess I'm not getting a raid in the sweet spot. No, we're out of uh, we're out of bombs. That's awkward. <laughs> it's like the music stops. They're like, oh. Fortunately, they give you an option to just kind of eat yourself. Ah, could not get over there in time to stop that cannibal. There must be a sweet spot that I'm just not hitting. I don't know. Don't get it. It's a super pesky cannibal. Oh, he had some gold, too. SOB. Where do you have to be for me to hit you, friend? Oh wow, that did not hit him. Um, if someone has an idea of what I'm missing here. We both go down together. Yeah, I only get the four that I pick up at the start. It must be like a, a very sweet spot that I'm missing in the corner here when he gets to the very top. I probably should, I need to like time this just right. When he's at the bottom, I dropped it. Cooked myself, that's awesome. There's definitely nowhere else to go. I can't melt any of these floors because they're like, they're reinforced. All we have is the, oh, all we have is the bombs. Problem is we haven't even seen him blow up once. So, I would have thought that these bombs have like two tiles of reach. Well, I guess I need three technically. All right, do it when he's at the top. That's at the top. 
There it is. Sweet spot. All right. Yeah, it was just a very tight pocket. Now you can't drop it on off the side. It's it only drops like at his feet, unfortunately. Appreciate the suggestions. We got there. Might be my favorite. Little chimes, the marimba, whatever. All right, let's move on again. As much as I love the mines, let's go to level 30, not 34. Now you see me. Dodge the posse. Dig your grave. I guess I should have gone to 31 technically, shouldn't I have? There's also next puzzle. There we go. All right, so now we are in the fortress, cave, ruins. I think we can like fit through here. Oh, it's a little cubby hole <laughs> where we can be all stealthy. Okay. This is sneaky. It's a lot of guys. I don't think we want this many dudes bunching up over here. I think that's the idea. You need to like jump on this one. Yeah, okay. Oh, the sound effect of my bones. <laughs> Crunching under the cannibal. all about avoiding these guys. Okay, this is okay. Down with that. All right, that worked out. We have one bomb to go right now. Why do I feel like these guys are going to drop down? Don't know that I can make it to that. You know, it would be beautiful if I could every single one of these guys to drop. I know they're gonna try coming over here. All right, get them all to drop. There we go, fools. Oh no, they have a coin. <laughs> That's not good. They're all like right there. We're gonna have to blow them all up together. That's gonna be tough. Oh, it's right there. It's teasing me. All right, we'll get some more bombs and then we'll figure this out. Another one of them has a coin. Bastard. Bing. God bless that one that just keeps climbing up and down the ladder there. It's a trier. Love a trier. <laughs> He's like, I swear I'm gonna get him, guys. He's gonna be delicious. Just keep thinking that, man. Let's see, let's drop here. All right. Okay, you guys are up here now. I don't know what, is there a reason they keep inexplicably dropping their coins? 
I'm worried I'm not gonna be able to kill them all, though. I'm gonna go through my bombs pretty quickly. Ooh, fellas. Okay, fellas. I'll go up the top. This is pretty Donkey Kong right now. I'm with you on that. Love it. A whole line of them. Like, we will get him. Reminds me a little Quest of Glory 2, Shapir. Definitely some Shapirian music here. Alright, one of you other guys isn't hanging on to any of these coins, are you? So at this point, we should be able to... There we go. Alright, we should be able to just do the same thing. We shouldn't even have to use any of these bombs. Big Top. An old, old game, Big Top. I remember I used to have a... Uh, trying to think of like what I even called it. Every February, we did like super, super old games on this channel. I don't remember what it was called offhand. Dang it, fellas. All right, that guy's happily stuck there. We'll just drop all these guys down. Keep our bombs. There we go. And we got a clear path. Sweet. Big top. I'll have to check that out. Yeah, I used to play really old games. Whatever it was called. Whatever that theme month that we did every year. The salad days of the channel. Games like night games. Like stuff from like, you know, 86, 87. Um. Kingdom of Kras, Dark Castle, stuff like that. All right. We got there. Let's move on to 46, why don't we? Whoa, I see. I see where the name of that one comes from. All right. So we proved that we can do that one. <laughs> Dodge the posse. Yep. I said stay out of the basement. Let's find out what they're talking about. Ooh. This one was always very visually stunning. I like this. All right, so you were asking new mechanics every time. We now have Bucket of Sticky and Invisible Pits. Don't like the Invisible Pits. Really don't like the invisible pits, actually. So the sticky you just drop right on right beneath you. No, wait, no, I just dropped it actually. I didn't mean to do that. You do it like this. And then all of a sudden they have to go stick through it. So you guys should get away from some baddies this way. Take their time. Just working up a bigger appetite. Uh, okay. I don't know why it doesn't occur to them just like climb over the sticky to get to me. They're not that smart. I'm trying to think. Best way to get out of here. That might not work out that well, actually, because that's just going to, yeah, invite more bad, more cannibals to come eat me. Tight window we're working with here. Can we do it? Oh, yeah. I love bouncing on their head. Oh, I could have gone. Nah, I can't get, really get anywhere there. All right. That's the best sound effect. 
Fantastic. All right. So where did I drop before? It might be a pit up here. No, we're okay. All right. Got more sticky here. Uh, I don't know where that guy's going. He's might. Is there a pit here? Yeah, he knew. He knew. Oh, all right, friend. Oh, which I mean, cannibal. Now I'm content to just do one level of each of these. Make our way to the end. Pretty proud of this, though. <laughs> level 46. Done. Assuming there's not a pit here. All right, then. Sweet. <laughs> All right. On to 61. Goop him. Ice tree. I like that. That was exactly where I want to go. So I'm assuming it's going to be an ice theme. Oh. This is pretty. Oh, okay, fellas. Where did he go? Uh, but these guys won't kill me, right? Okay. I like their ice music. All right, what do we do with these ropes is the question. So it's a noose. Oh, it's a trap. Take your time setting it up, by the way, Load Runner. Huh? Classic. Oh, those other guys did not go for it. So is that guy just stuck there indefinitely so we can rope up all these dudes? Because that's pretty clutch. Arctic cannibals, that's right. Hopefully there's not more pits. Not a fan of the pits. Fan of bombs. Love me some bombs. Pick up another trap. Oh, that's a lot of cannibals coming my way. I don't think I can... I can't crush through here. We need to use... Well... Yeah, we definitely need to use... At least one bomb here. Can we be quite quick about this, Load Runner? Oh, my goodness. Barely had time. Is that going to respawn? That should. Run! There you go. Woo. Give him the cold shoulder. Oh, yeah. I don't think I can get through them with the sticky. All right, that guy didn't follow me up, though, so we're okay. Extra sticky if we need it. Um, Man, it'd be just so much easier to use the... I don't think it's going to hit them, though. We learned that on another level. That bomb won't hit those cannibals. Grab some stick here. Are they going to come down here? They're going to be ready for me, aren't they? Mm, I might want them over here, actually, now that I think about it. Come get me, you filthy animals. Ah, oh, that's going to kill that guy. That guy's screwed. Uh, okay. Alright, everybody come this way. I guess... Stick him. I feel like I'm Kevin McAllister all of a sudden. I don't like that that one's kind of smart. All right, let's tie him up. I think we can do this. I don't know how close. There we go. This should be enough time. Beautiful. Alright, 
while they're mucking about, quite literally down at the bottom. We'll have some time to grab the rest of this stuff. So far, considering the massive leaps I've taken, I haven't hit anything that's thrown me for too big of a loop. Oh, that one's going rogue down there. I don't like that. This one's for you, buddy. Enjoy it. He has no idea what he's about to walk into. All right, let's grab this. Get that one. He's trapped. That's good. Let's hold on to this bomb for now. We'll wait for this ground to respawn. I like the little triangle effect they got going here. Okay, all the time in the world now. It's a lovely thing. We've used all of our traps, all of our cannibal traps. Might as well get this goop. And hopefully none of these other cannibals have any more gems. And that's it. There we go. Brilliant. Now it's just awkward without the music. It's just four cannibals swinging from some traps I set up. Well, I quietly, <laughs> awkwardly see myself out. Brilliant. Love it. More ropes. All right, let's move on. The midway point. Might even start skipping some of these. And <laughs> this is just another mine type level. So we now have the drill. Come on. And the drill is good for that, obviously. For drilling. Those don't reform as far as I know. They're permanent one way or another. All right, we faked that guy out. Sweet. I needed that. Actually, it wasn't smart of me to not dig a little bit deeper. That was... That wasn't the best. That's okay. Alright, fellas. We got that guy to cough that one up. That's good. Idiots! Mind you, the Jackhammer in the second Worms game. What's the best worms game? I see Rich mention uh, Worms Armageddon. If we got some more Worms fans in the stream or in the uh, just watching the, the upload of this. Thanks for watching the upload of this, by the way. All right, we finally have a chance to, cr uh, to fix our mistake from earlier. Probably should have just kept cutting through the ground there. We got most of the way. I think that was pretty straightforward. Let's move along to... Ah! I mean, gas them goofy. All right, this is the gas I was talking about. The spray that you can use. Not bug spray. Cannibal spray. I love this addition. This mechanic here. All right. And they get all high as hell. <laughs> Start dancing around in a daze. I think there was 
a hole there. Yeah, there's definitely a hole there. That's okay. Because we have infinite spray. And I love it. That one for you. Kind of looks like a cannon, but... Nope. Cannibal spray. Yeah, no excuses when you have the spray. I say that now, I'll probably get eaten pretty soon. Hopefully those middle bits there are not invisible. Shortcut. I was trying to shoot there. I did not mean to jump off. That was, that was silly. Unless you want to join me. There you go. Be silly with me, cannibal. It's like a more rockin' version of the uh, the first level theme. So we're in the underground kind of volcanic lava. Oh, okay. All right. I guess we're guess we're heading the other way. As I said, as many sprays as you need. For whatever reason, it does not affect non cannibals. Maybe it's just for folks that have a, a human rich diet. Sort of acts up with that. That's the joke. <laughs> A little McBain. I love it when M McBain branched out and did some stand up. You suck, McBain. He threw a grenade into the crowd. Thin skin at McBain. Let's get the heck out of here and on to 106. Fantastic. Gassum. It was Gassum Goofy, now it's just Gassum. Unintentional Rescue. We saving? Maybe there's like a trapped cannibal. Oh, yeah. What about that bass in this one? The pickaxe down there. I don't remember how to use the Pickaxe. Maybe that's like a diagonal thing. Maybe it's a left to right thing, actually. All right. I don't think I can. I can't burn out the one uh, at the bottom of the ladder. What we can do. Let's see. One, two, three. This should work, right? I think the math checks out on this if we're fast enough. Gotta be quick. All right, that's gonna start filling in, but we should be able to get over one in time. There we go. Yeah, we're fine. It's gonna get a little claustrophobic for our load runner in the short term. Of course, I don't know how I'm gonna get out of here once we have the pickaxe now that I think about it, but better mean trapped with those uh, those guys over there. Let's see how this works. Okay. What did that do? Is that gonna disappear? I honestly don't see how that helped me. I'm just trapped down here, right? I mean, that protects me from bad guys, sure, but like, I'm still stuck down here. I don't get that. Let's die. Very rude level. I'm like, 
I don't know, but I guess we could use that bomb. Maybe it's just, it's just to distract me, that pick. And the door is under, hit under the gold. Do you think something different might happen in the corner there? It is animated differently. I'm hoping that the door is somewhere on the bottom row and that's just to like distract you and make you think that, oh, I have to use that to succeed somehow. And you get trapped and you waste a life. I think we need to do a very carefully placed bomb while we're walking on these guys' heads and then dart to the right. It's gonna be tricky. Gonna have to be in the middle guy too. And they're gonna come to the right, so we definitely... Okay. I don't know. Definitely need to have that first gem though. That's true. Quandrina Quarry. I think I think that is really just to like create a little blockade. A temporary blockade to give you a little bit of a respite, like if there's a dude chasing you, just be like, and cause a little cave in. Oh, melt the wall, next to him, that's a good point. Good point, TK. So, I need to do something, something like this. Uh, no. Uh, no, because I can't, we can't, we can only shoot down and left or right of us. Unless I was missing something there. I don't think there's enough. Killed three of them. I think that's it. I think I need to kill as many of them as I can and then like trap the last one in a hole if possible. I just don't know if I'll have time to get over there. So really kill the, th kill the three on the right and then get that last one to get sucked up into the ground. I think that's the solution. I feel pretty good about that. Yeah, I just don't have enough ground to uh, take out the supporting column here is the only problem. Because you can't shoot underneath your feet. You can only shoot to the left or right of your feet. So check it. Here's how we do this. They should fall into the hole. Was there a hole underneath any of them after that bomb went off? I know I'm dropping it on their heads. So that might kind of make things tricky. But uh, it's a very tight window though. We can also use the bomb to liberate them, I'm realizing. If I shoot while next to a wall, it doesn't do anything. Like, I'm trying to shoot to the left, it doesn't do it. If I shoot to the right, it's going to take out what's underneath me right there. So. All right, so maybe the bomb, like like the clue was there in the, in the level title, we need to rescue them. I think my way could have still worked. It's just very tricky with the, the spacing and everything. I don't think that's how they would have you do it. This is probably it. 
Assuming this will take out both blocks. I don't know. We'll find out. All right. So they now have a way to try to get to me. They got eaten. They should get eaten. Awesome. Now yeah, they're just kind of stuck. All right. Yeah, the bomb. So clearly the bomb. Yeah, I'm generally not amazing at puzzle games. Did I ever beat Lolo? I forget. <laughs> Someone confirmed there's a Lolo Let's Play on this channel somewhere. Maybe a Lolo 2? Forget. Alright. Now it would be extremely cruel if the door was not down here after I did all this work. We'll see. Jason Puzzle Game, that was fun. That thing was tricky. That was frustrating at some points. Thankfully, they gave you the solution and everything if you needed it. Just couldn't figure it out. There it is. And since someone asked, uh, uh, I guess I can't use it. There it is. Use it in the corner. Yeah, it just drops in a little, little ground. So they're like, all right, it's not relevant on this level, but just so you know, that's what the pickaxe does. <laughs> they're like, get used to it. You will need it. All right, three more levels to go. There's a green door. Skull boys run. All right, stab in the dark. Literally. Well, this is kind of terrifying because now we have cannibals coming at us and we don't know where from. And the music's kind of like a mashup between Bernard's and Michael's soundtracks from Maniac Mansion. Definitely hear Michael's like. <laughs> Lots of fog of war. So you have to remember where all the drops are. Hopefully they're all in this line. All right, that's handy. Nice. That would have been really repetitive if we had to do that over and over again. <laughs> <That'd be laughs> extremely esoteric. Might just be you and me. <laughs> well, anyone on this channel, probably. when that sound cuts out. Just the silent sounds of one load runner shimmying across a rope in the dark and there's some some skulls. Neat. I know there's probably another platform I need to jump on but I just don't know where it is. Alright, so two more to the right of that at the very least. Well, I guess that's all I really know for now. <laughs> I don't even know if I ever got this far when I was a kid. Assuming they didn't have the, uh, the level skip option. I don't know. Ah, oh, son of a, it was three. When I was dropping, it was two. Ah, idiot. All right, indulge me, everyone. Let's do that again. I should have gone over one more to be safe. There's no reason not to do that. Yeah, yeah, Load Runner always lands like a cat. It's kind of impressive. So do the cannibals, for that matter. They all have very reinforced shins and ankles. We're in their, uh, I don't even know. 
don't even know what they're wearing. All right. Just got that. Oh, handy. Yeah, I'm not gonna miss not playing all those levels. All right, the penultimate level, as far as this Let's Play is concerned, at least. Dark deduction. Ooh, the neighbors, this sounds creepy. I like they give you the uh, the floor plan, the Kevin McAllister. Oh, this is the, this is like the final stretch of areas here, actually. So I'll do this one and then we'll do the last level. If we could be the last level. So we got the teleporter this time. That is the new and final mechanic which they introduce. Can I knock out these floors? Yes, I can. Oh, yeah, if they're already standing on it, it will not give, unfortunately. Drop for me, my man. There you go, buddy. You sitting on anything? Oh, God. I like they have to wait while he's trying to climb out. All right. You fellas didn't... Oh, God, you can teleport too? <laughs> no, thank you. How do they get beaten on the levels before? When I was like, I'm not sure. The teleporter seems familiar, so I must have gotten this far. I'm just going to assume that yes, I did beat all the levels. As much as I played it as a kid. Drop some gold. Yeah, that's a bad idea. I'm getting greedy. Don't pick that up. Uh, you gonna pick that up? No. Psych. All right, they moved down pretty fast. Like, uh, was it Diddy Kong? Forget which of the Kongs shimmied up faster than the others. Ooh, all right. It's getting tight. I think we just stand on this guy indefinitely by, by ourselves some time. That poor guy on the left, the party's over here, man. He's like, you just haven't gotten in a position for me to, uh, to really do anything with that yet. Come here, buddy. I like that when they come out of their Jesus pose and they're like, what? What's going on? How did I get here? <laughs> what if Load Runner and Mirror's Edge had a baby? Splendid. Let me go the fancy Load Runner way. We shoot our own paths. All right, let's go to the last level. 150 of 150, Hammer Horror. All right, give me some help if you see the solution before I do. All right, we got a cannibal pepper spray. I like that. That's good. We got a jackhammer. A key. Don't really need the pepper spray right now, so let's pick up the jackhammer. Spray is the solution, that is all you need. Two right, Oh, that's not good. Am I screwed? I am screwed. All right. So don't drop off that ledge. That's the first part of the solution. <laughs> Speed jackhammer, I'm assuming the yellow. Kind of the caution plates. Let's try it right now. Right. Got some stick here. Love that sound. Especially when there's no music in the back. What? No? I can't, I can't shoot out this ground? Why not? All right, we can't shoot out the ground. Doesn't seem super load runnery. Oh, I guess like, I 
can actually use the pointer here. I guess like this is one of the few places we can actually burn out. And we'll probably have to do that, all right. All right, I'm with you. I got gotcha. you. I did have bombs, I could have used the bombs. I just think, I think the, the drill is more important than the spray. I got bombs. All right, let's get these guys to follow us nice and tight. Actually, we will spray them. There we go. Plenty of spray. And let's do the fast way here. They'll still be kind of dazed. Got them extra high. Yeah, we hit them like five times. All right. Let's chill out here for a second. So the key, unfortunately, will replace our drill. Uh, that's actually an easy fix, though. We can... Well, no. All right. Now I gotta do it again. That's okay. So pop back down. Jump back in the... Teleporter. Pick this up. All right. Should I do one more? I guess it doesn't matter. All right. And leave that there, I guess? I don't know. Yeah, we're about to teleport down. That makes sense. All right, pick up the key. I think we might have to use a bomb on these guys. I think once we unlock this door, we gotta go back for the... Yeah, there's no way to beat them. Don't need the key anymore. Awesome. All right. Well, now I'm worried about this guy. What do we do about this guy? Is the question. He keeps coming a little bit more over. We get him. We get you to join up with your friends here, buddy. They want to hang out. Yeah, let's get them all, all bunched up. So this dash doesn't seem that hard. Let's get them high. There we go. Oh, extra. That's the dang stuff right there. What? Who ate me? You're high, dude. How do you... <laughs> I guess when you're that high, you do tend to get the munchies. That actually makes sense. <laughs> Solved my own... Uh, answered my own question there. <laughs> oh, well. It was a good idea in theory. <laughs> and I was fast... I was walking right by... to waste a bomb because I didn't plan it. That's alright. I'm sure I won't need it. Famous last words. Yeah, that that was just a waste of time. Um, well, uh, I don't know, we get all our drilling done. Theoretically. Okay, he was holding on to one. That's actually pretty handy. All right, I'm gonna get everybody in an individual thing this time. All right, we got the drill. Um. Oh God, I screwed that up. I can't get to that treasure now. Son of a bitch. So close. I was like, I got this. Nah, all right. Thanks for tuning in, Spanky Ham. Greetings. Greetings from the Cannibal Factory. 
We're having fun. <laughs> All right, spray these guys this time. And spray, and I'm gonna dig. Spray and dig. It's a two-part process. I don't like it, but we have to do it. And he's just, he's like over there already. <laughs> I am all city here. I almost believe you. Alright, he did not. Alright, that's good. Oh! Oh, you joined me, didn't you? Good for you, friend. Actually, that's perfect. That's a good spot for you. That worked out very well. He's like, you'll uh, you'll get me out of here, right? Nope. All right, so we'll get these guys up the ladder halfway. What's up, DCM? How you doing, buddy? About to unlock. I dedicate this door unlocked to you. Boom. Nothing in there yet. We're about to fix that. All right, this is the one. I can feel it. We gotta swoop down and get that gold, obviously. Plenty of bombs to make this happen. I don't know, it's looking good. Are you guys getting off there? Why are you getting off there? Whatever, oh no. Oh, because I'm on this level. And they're like, okay. That makes sense. Don't break up, guys. I like you guys together. Explain to me how that makes sense. You guys. Alright, as long as you're bunched up. I don't mind. Please explode. Woo! I'm doing this one sloppy, but we're getting it done. Please be no pits here. Invisible pits. That'd be bad. Time to have one of those. All right. Let's get the dank spray and get the hell out of here. We'll beat the final level, right? That's That means it's the hardest level in the game. That's just how that works beat any level in this game if you beat the last level. Let's get them to follow us on this path here. Watch that guy in the top left have a gem and he's like, sorry, should have asked. I guess theoretically I could blow him up if I needed to. Nah, we're good. It's a parting gift for me. Get baked. We're getting out of here. In silence. See ya! And my favorite sign-off sound. Oh, I forgot. Uh, after, after every 15th level when the, uh, the background changes, you get one of these little cutscenes. That's how I should have done it. <laughs> oh well. You get this one. Slightly larger animated version of Load Runner. It's not the smartest when I'm not controlling him. <laughs> what? F6, man. You were dragging ass. Yeah, I love these cutscenes. Completely forgot about them. It's basically shows him using like the new mechanics to mess on some cannibals over and over again. They're pretty hilarious. If you're eight years old. <laughs> P 
play mid-pack music. Failure playing the music. Good ending. <laughs> that was Load Runner Legend Returns. Do, 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 do. Make up my own music here. Good music in this game, though. I like it. I actually uh, had to tweak around the Sound Blaster settings. That took me back just to get that fancy MIDI, which is now not playing. So maybe we screwed that up a little bit, but um, man, I'm not sure how long I can sit here and watch this. See how this is going to play out like this. Lots of mini xylophone and marimbas. Don't forget about the marimbas. He's going to be waiting there a while. All right. There you go. That was uh, from one of Sierra's. I guess they were the publisher, essentially. But, um, yeah. All right. That That's cool. Before... That warning takes care of the entire screen. Maybe we should uh maybe we should get out of here. Thanks for watching. That was a little blast from the past. Load Runner. The legend returns based on the original Load Runner game from Doug Smith. And uh yeah, we'll see you next time for more fun, fun times right here on Let's Play with the Brigands. We'll see you then. Every time.